So uh, the top three takeaways from uh, Goa Fest, uh, you know, day one, day two, and day three. What would you say they are? Even though I must have missed some of the page because I was not there, but from what I understand, the talk by Jonathan on day one. I just call them, a lot of people uh, have mentioned about how impactful yeah, the talk yeah, was, yeah, how he covered uh, the whole length and breadth of subjects in that. And I also understand last last yes, uh, yesterday, in fact, uh, certainly the media and the, the three D's awards you know, stole the limelight. The fact that there was a Grand Prix winner, mm. the fact that uh, there was uh, a lot of uh, Say. The other it is no longer just a media award. It's a day one award which covers media and the three Ds, which is design, direct, and digital. So I'm happy that uh, it has reached that point. And of course, today the day is not over yet. So, so far, the talk by John Philip Jones is quite impressive. I like that. Also, a lot of focus has been on digital this time. Yes. Um, I mean, what would be your take on uh, the role of digital? Uh, you know, say in the coming years. Is digital is really the flavor of the day, maybe the flavor of the year, the flavor of the last few years. Uh, if you look at almost all seminars, digital dominates because it's a new medium, because it's an evolving medium. Uh, it's also fashionable to talk about it. So I'm only hoping that it can translate into real uh, benefit to clients. Because today, uh, we are still in a TV and print uh, economy as far as advertising is concerned. And not more than 3-4% of the client's money is actually going into digital. So I'm hoping that that can change. And I'm hoping that through these seminars and through the sort of trend-setting work that each of these creative um, people speaking here do, it will enlarge the digital community, it will enlarge interest, it will get mainstream creative people into digital. When that happens, then the medium will expand. Uh, have you, uh, I mean, have we seen an improved creatives in terms of digital, you know, digital creatives? Yes, there is definitely an improvement. Till two years ago, mm -hmm. the improvement was not there yeah. because we were a new medium. Mm. It is still not attracting the top talent yeah. of, let's say, mainstream creatives, mm. those who are, let's say, good in print, TV, etc. Mm. They've not yet gone into digital. Mm. But when that happens in okay. India, the real growth will then happen. Mm -hmm. But the fact that we had a Grand Prix in digital, mm. that's, that's a very good fact. Right. Also, we, you know, Goa Fest 2012 wanted the participation of more marketers, young marketers especially. Would you say those objectives have been met and, uh, you know, have you... Young marketers? Yes. In the, yes, I think so, because uh, the fact that we have... Everywhere we are putting accent on the youth, whether it is in subsidized entry, the delegates, in jury selection also, we made sure that some of the younger judges are coming. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, so as far as youth is concerned, whether it is a subject or whether it is in the selection of judges, whether it is in the preference for delegates, everywhere we are giving emphasis to youth. All right. One final question. Expectations from Goa Fest 2013. Hmm. Maybe, you know, say the coming Goa Fest, what would they be? Even bigger, even uh, more brighter, <laughs> more smarter in terms of selection, maybe the speeches could be by creative stars who be invited in time. Uh, these are some of the learning points. So I would expect more of that. And more participations more from? More participation from companies, more broad facing, all that I would expect. Okay. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you.